Welcome to Business Bites. I'm Lishono Lomukoni. The Nigerian market is closed today for a public holiday, so we'll only be looking at South Africa and Kenya. The Johannesburg Stock Exchange ended the day three quarters of a percent weaker on 31,345 points. We spoke to Andrew Didburner from Canon Asset Managers looking at Bala World's annual results. They had a very tough year. Obviously, it's a cyclical company. Um, with the recession last year and equipment making up a, a big part of their business, um, they had a tough year. Down headline earnings per share down 40%, which was in line with guidance as expected. The second half of the year was better though. Um, their order book is picking up at the moment with um, the commodity-led recovery taking traction at the moment. Um, we are beginning to see their order book f fill up. Uh, construction though is still, after the World Cup, construction is still dampening the order book a bit and they see that picking up. The NSC20 closed five points weaker to end the day on 4,541 points. We spoke to Kenneth Minjire from Genghis Capital looking at central bank shoring up reserves. Um, yes, I think I would agree, especially looking at um, the way they've been coming to the market and buying um, up euros. I think they've done 10 million in the last uh, seven days, five days actually. Um, and with all the anxiety around the dollar, um, the euro is looking a, a bit more stable. So yes, I would agree they're shoring up their foreign exchange mm -hmm. reserves. For more news and videos, go to abndigital.com.